let's see. Let's see what that's talking about. I, Brie on TV, am the first African American woman to step foot on the moon. Like, that's how I feel. That's exactly how I feel with these moon boots on. Like, I have superpowers on the moon. You feel me? Put your head on my shoulder. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for tuning in yet again to another episode of Brit on TV, where I am your lovely host, who loves to travel free so in today's video we have oh I kind of shook my table a little too hard now we will be doing yet again another unboxing one of my favorite things to do because as you all know from the show in the back I don't know if you can see it but I love to shop. The reason why I purchased the infamous, the one and only, the do you even have some in your closet or have you even heard of them? Moon boots. Me and a few of my girlfriends are going to Breckenridge, Colorado. And this trip is literally in less than like a week right so when you're going skiing you need to have the proper gear you don't just show up in Colorado and be like I'm ready to ski or partake in excursions involving the snow some people they rent everything that is offered to be rented when um, they travel to Colorado but I wanted to purchase um, some moon boots because moon boots are known to be waterproof boots that basically you know will protect your feet in the snow okay okay Blah, 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 blah. <sighs> okay, this isn't important. These are my moon boots that I will be rocking that you've probably seen Arrogant Tay, Ari Fletcher, and a lot of more other like socialite celebs. You've probably seen them rocking these exact moon boots. I just kind of felt like you just can't go in the snow without the snow boots, which is the moon boots, you know? Okay, so the reason why I decided to get white, I don't even think I decided. Let me tell you how impossible, literally impossible it was for me to purchase moon boots. my moon boots through Amazon because I purchased them through Amazon this is how the packaging came it says moon boot the original and then we have this see-through clear I guess reusable bag Ooh. okay 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 y'all oh my god so I will zoom in so that way you can get a better visual of the boot. But this is the moon boot that goes all the way to the calf. I want to say they do have kind of like ankle or booty style moon boots as well. I didn't find those attractive. On the back, uh, I don't know. What logo is this? I don't know what logo this is on the back of the moon boot, but I do know it says the original nobody can really come for me 
and say that I don't have the original moon boots because baby, we're gonna let them nap. As far as if they have, what is it called? Like knockoff moon boots? I don't know. Cause I'm like new to the moon boot game. On the side, it says moon boots. And then I do want to let you know in regards to the bottom or the side, the bottom side of the moon boot, it's like a cream color and it has like a rigid edge to it. Child, I don't know. It's hard, so it has a hard base. And then on the back, on the bottom of the moon boot, it has that same logo and it says, Ticinia, Ticinia child. It may be like a category of the moon boot, Ticinia. So that, that's what this means. This means Ticinia. I really feel like I'm saying it wrong though. The non-stick traction at the bottom. It has like a squishy feel to it. I really like the lace up of the boot. I think it's cute. So on the sides, they have the brackets that the lace goes through. And then you have your first crossing. Well, you have multiple crossings, like, you know, regular shoelace. The and top also includes the shoestring that is going around the rugged fringe portion. It's like really squishy, like a bouncy house. In regards to sizing of the moon boots, in European size, I got a 39.41. In UK size, I got a size 6 slash 7.5. And in US, I got a size 7 slash 8.5. I wear a size 8 to an 8 and a half in all boots. And in heels, I wear a size 9. In kids, I wear a size 6 to a 6 and a half. Child, my feet be all over the place. But I do have wide feet. And because I have wide feet, I'm pretty sure that these are going to fit like a glove. But one thing I want to say in regards to sizing, in regards to the moon boots. Now, if you've never heard of moon boots and you're thinking about getting moon boots, or if you have already um, been browsing to purchase moon boots, then you are probably very confused in regards to the sizing because I myself have never seen a shoe or a brand combine like multiple sizes. So if, if you wear a size like me, then that's when you will purchase the bulk of seven, seven and a half, eight, eight and a half or something like that. It was really confusing. But if you have bigger feet and you wear a size nine and above, then they have a category for that as well. I don't know. Like, how, how do you know which one is the left and which one is the right? I damn it. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what it's come at. Okay, so first things first, because I have a big calf, I am going to have to loosen the top string. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I did right on the sizing. And like I said, I knew from trying on this one first that I need to adjust the top shoestring because <laughs> baby got the calves. It's giving. When I take drugs, I go to the moon, y'all. Spoiled hmm? bitch, two thousand dollar shoes, y'all. I feel like I need a, um, I need like a long stick. So that way, you know how they be doing when they go to the moon and they stand on the moon and they stick like the flag in it. We gonna use like, I, Brie on TV and the first African American woman to step foot on the moon. Like that's how I feel. That's exactly how I feel with these moon boots on like. I have superpowers on the moon. You feel me? Thank you everyone for watching this video to the very end. If you have any questions in regards to these moon boots, 
drop a comment down below if you yourself have purchased the moon boots then definitely comment down below because i want to hear what you got to say in regards to your review on your moon boots Subscribe to my channel if you have not already subscribed. We have a lot more content regarding the snow, packing for the snow, how to plan for the snow, and so forth. I will be taking y'all along with me on my trip to Breaker Ridge. So stay tuned for that. I am excited. Hopefully you are too because child, we're going snowing together. Like this video if you like this type of content. I enjoy my unboxing, so hopefully you do too. Turn on your post notifications because like I said, we got a lot more in store. I will catch y'all on the moon because like I said, I got on these moon boots. You can't tell me nothing, okay? When I take drugs, I go to the moon.